a quick PS of this video is choppy as hell. This video was filmed months ago before COVID-19 was even a thing. Please be safe but do not panic. Wash your hands and do not touch your face. Please don't hoard things you don't need and allow other people to be able to purchase what they need for their families. Now back to our regularly scheduled programming. This is not a tutorial. Previously on Fuck Me Up Fam. Flashback. Of flashback. Hello world and all who inhabit it. Um, I can hear the people from my last, not my last video, but the last video about this topic screaming. I can hear it just shh, shh, listen, listen, can you hear it? Yeah, they're fucking screaming at me to not do this and everybody else who's watching this video hasn't seen the last video because yes I've done this before <laughs> is also screaming at me. But here's the thing, I'm dumb, and um, you know, I don't learn from my mistakes, so we're gonna do it anyway. So, last night, I already washed my hair. Yes, I'm gonna wash my hair again, because that's what it says on the instructions, but I hadn't washed my hair in like three weeks. What? So I like washed it, because I tried the shampoo that they recommended, and uh, that shit is way too expensive to be using globs of that all over my head. So I just shampooed and conditioned, and then right now, I left a deep conditioner in my hair. I won't be mad if I fuck up my hair, but I'll be mad if I pay somebody else to fuck up my hair, you know what I mean? Now I know what you may be thinking, but why though? I'm tired of looking like a crack -a -a -a. <laughs> No, okay, I think I look like a crackhead because I'm sick and tired of dealing with this, okay? As somebody who is extremely tender-headed, having to go through, like, especially last night, and thoroughly detangle my hair. Which took over an hour, by the way. If you think my lazy ass is gonna do that, you got me all the way, not partially, but all the way fucked up. I'm not gonna lie to you, I got kind of sick of my hair a couple months ago, and by a couple, I mean like maybe four or five months ago, and I decided to put a texturizer in it, which if you didn't know is a mild creamy crack. I just realized I don't have gloves, so we're gonna improvise. <laughs> I mean, come on, it's not that bad. It's pretty creative. You gotta give me creative points. Look at this. Do you see the craftsmanship on this? Like, come on, bro. Like, don't even lie to me and tell me this shit ain't gonna be on Kanye's new Yeezy line. <laughs> you know, these were good in theory, but I don't think I can wear these. Like, it's, I can't feel anything. I can't feel where I'm putting the product. So we're just gonna sacrifice the health of my hands. Oh yeah, we have to do a length check. A length. Ooh, I almost pulled up my shirt the wrong way. Eh. My hair is right here. My nipples here. This, my hair is here. Let's just ply half an inch from the scalp. Ooh, <coughs> it's still a spot. I'm not even joking y'all, it smells like it could give you cancer, so it's great that I'm now applying it to my scalp and hair with bare hands. Uh, uh, it's been two years since I've known that smell. I hate it. You can see it's already working! Yes! Straighten this hair, baby boy. Straighten it. Okay, this is getting kinky, and I, <laughs> I didn't sign up for that. So it says that you're supposed to check your hair every five minutes, but leave this on for five to thirty minutes. I'm probably gonna have to leave this on closer to thirty minutes. So <laughs> I haven't been like timing anything. I've just been you know, checking my hair constantly to see how far it's processed. So this is what we're looking like so far. I don't know if you can see that. Look at it. Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! I want all of you to look at it! 
<laughs> it's like it's good to switch up your hair okay is it good to put necessarily put chemicals in your hair no but I'm doing it anyway <laughs> and I used basically the entire 14.1 fluid ounce thing on my hair I look like two people right now I look like Vic Fuentes and I think I'm saying his last name right I don't know and Kellen Quinn from Pierce the Veil and Sleeping with Sirens. Don't mind the way it looks right now. I made the mistake of putting a leave-in conditioner in it that wasn't the Liceo Crystal and now it's kind of like stiff. I have had this hair for a week and I am kind of sick of my puby ends. So we're just gonna cut them off. <laughs> I kind of have like a, like a Dora haircut right now. My issue and why I'm kind of scared right now is because I don't want the Dora to take over. I really don't. Do you see that? Do you see the pube right now? It's a broomstick and I hate it. This is gonna end shit and I know it is. No, I'm not cutting it this short, okay? I do not wanna hear it. I don't wanna hear it. I'm not that crazy, okay? Well, I mean, why am I closing my eyes right now? This is not the time. I don't know if they're like even or anything. So, <laughs> number three, three. Is a magic number. Okay, this one is way too long. Oh my god, the anxiety is gonna kill me. Oh my god, I can't do this. I can't do this. I'm doing it. Oh my god. <gasps> Ew, look at that. What is that? That looks like a makeup brush from Morphe or something. Ooh, it feels like a makeup brush from Morphe. Oh no, it's Dora. It's so Dora. Oh god, that's so short. Oh my god, it feels so nice. Okay, I'm gonna cut this one. Listen, ASMR already. This side still looks longer. What is that? Maybe if I just kind of like, you know? I keep saying, you know, like I'm Jin from BTS and it's kind of annoying me. <laughs> Word of caution, do not cut your hair without looking because that is exactly what I just did. I'm going to just do this. Oh, by the way, before I started filming this video, like the, the day I did my hair, I cut off, I, I already cut off like three inches. So, yeet. God, my hand hurts. You see what I mean about my hair being thick? I've literally been cutting for forever. Okay. I feel like that's a little bit more exciting. Is it shorter in the back? Oh no. Spam F in the chat, please, for my hair. Cause I'm just kind of wrecking it. <laughs> this one's not awful, right? Please tell me it's not awful. <laughs> I need to stop cutting. That, that's my issue. I need to stop. I need to put the scissors down and I need to stop. I'm stopping, okay? I'm, I'm going to, I'm, I'm gonna put the scissors down and I'm going to stop. I'm, I'm actually like, just, I'm gonna stop. You know what? I think I'm actually gonna stop at this point because I think that's like, it's not even, like in the fucking slightest. Euphoria, Calvin Klein. But it looks a lot healthier. Like, look at my ends now. Look at that. Yes. I went from like literal, like I say every five seconds, I went from literal pubes to like shiny Pomeranian, which I'm not mad at. So I think this haircut was a success. I just wanted to show you the aftermath of all of the hair that I cut off. So here it is in its pubic glory 
it is disgusting. Why I did not do this on a towel or something to get rid of the fact that I have to clean all this up, I have no idea. Listen, I do not have a big brain, so it moves just one step at a time and I did not think ahead, so. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, then good for you. And I will see you in my next one.